Hey, this is Edwin, and this is Google Plus Hangout on air, and we are doing the making of Shadow Lurkers, the movie. Uh, today we're talking with director Andrew Jenkins. How are you, Andrews? I'm great. I'm great. This is cool. Cool. And uh, you know, earlier we were talking about um, about uh, making film and uh, discussing, uh, you know, what it what it what it means to be an indie filmmaker. Um, you know, what are your thoughts about an indie filmmaker uh, versus a, a big budget filmmaker? It really comes down to just groundswell and buzz and, and people doing it themselves. I mean, anybody can get interest if you've got a multi-million dollar uh, media campaign. But what do you do if you're just some guy who has an idea and you want it to bring it to life? That's kind of the position I'm in. And I was lucky enough, I come from a commercial director background, and quite frankly, I begged, borrowed, and stole resources to make my own mini mer version of the movie just so I could show people what it would be like, what it would sound like, what it would feel like, which is you know, that much more of an experience than just reading a script. So the idea was, okay, if I don't have the resources of the studio, how can I bring it to life and get people interested? So that was kind of the concept behind just making it myself and doing it myself. And, and really, in many ways, that feels like the... The soul of the internet is a you know what do people do with it rather than some huge company? I mean you got Facebook who's kind of you know, <laughs> shown us what we're supposed to do with the internet. Well, what would you do if it was your own uh, you know making? Uh, that's kind of what the heart and soul of this project is. Well, you know it's funny because uh, Google Plusers you know feel that we're we're such an underground group and Google's you know it's still a fairly large company but we feel we feel like we're doors compared to uh, to Facebook. Uh, people and, and and you know and everybody that plays on the Facebook platform is that some something similar where where you're going through as a small pretty much one man studio? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, Google Plus. The concept is people connecting with other people and and you know finding interest and sharing those interests. And that's really what this is about. Is okay if you're just a guy trying to make a movie and get it out to people. How are you going to do it? I'm not a studio with a, you know millions of dollars in media, so take it straight to the people. And that's kind of what going through Google Plus is about, is just taking an idea, sharing it with people, and seeing what they think, and getting feedback. I mean, how cool would it be to make a movie that involves the audience and say, okay, what do you want to see in a movie? Let's talk about it. I'm making a mini version of the movie, but I'm in the making of making the bigger version. So I'd love to hear from people. Yeah, well, and, you know, I, I saw the mini movie, and it, it kind of it it shook me, you know. Do you, uh, you know, if you heard feedback that it was too scary or if it was uh, not scary enough, uh, you know, do you want the audience to uh, to talk talk to you in person about that? Yeah, I mean, if it's too scary, I'm going with it. But if it's not scary enough and I got some work to do, um, really, what I want to do is, I mean, I love the genre of horror and thriller because it's an audience genre. It's it's you know, people chat about it, people talk about it, and and people are passionate about the genre. Um, so, yeah, I just want to make a movie that people talk about and, and share. Um, instead of just buying my way into the industry, I just want to make something cool and hope that picks up momentum. Great. So uh, what, what would you say to the, uh, to the pluser community out there? Um, and actually, would you like to talk to a few plusers? I, you know, I, I see a few of them uh, that just came online. Uh, do, would you like to talk to a few of them? I'd love to talk to you. Okay, so uh, you know, so while I, you know, while I'm trying to get a few of them on there, uh, you know, uh, what would you want the plusers to say, um, you know, about your movie? Well, um, I think the spirit behind the movie and what the movie is is two different topics. But the spirit behind it is, um, what can you make on your own? What can you do on your own? If you had to sort of beg, borrow, and steal resources, what could you do? And that's what I've tried to do with this: is make something that just isn't, you know, um, you know, a huge studio production. At the same time, I think the the concept of an indie movie or something gets a bad rap. It, you know, that doesn't mean it has to look like it's made out of your garage. I want to make something cool, but I don't have the resources of a studio, so I'm somewhere in between. Um, okay. That'd be kind of an interesting to talk about. Um, what do you want to see in a movie? And and just talk to people about how I made this. It's kind of an, an odd story because I'm coming from a commercial director background, so I could kind of steal some gear and, and some resources and manpower that you know the average person wouldn't get to do. But I'm also not a big studio, so um, yeah. 
Okay. Great. Uh, okay, we're 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 gonna we're gonna you know take take a pause. Uh, but why don't you tell people when and where they can see the movie? Absolutely. So we're making a sort of mini featurette to tease the movie called Shadow Lurkers, and you'll find it January fourth, the night of a lunar eclipse, on YouTube forward slash Shadow Lurkers Movie dot com. Great. Thank, thanks for your time, and uh, you know ho hopefully you'll stick around, and uh, more people will will, will chime in. Uh, but you know, again, watch the movie at youtube.com forward slash shadow lurkers movie and we'll see you under the shadow. Right on.